again. We are now with Mrs. Maysam and Nasser, owner of One to One. Hello, Maysam. How are you doing? Hello, fine. Thank you. Thank you for having us at your, I don't know, studio. <laughs> um, as I said earlier, if we come in, we think this is an unfinished place. But again, this is your display of art and design, isn't yeah. it? Yes, it is. Can you tell us more about One to One? What is it and the services you provide? Uh, one to One is a design studio dedicated for conceptual architecture, mm -hmm. interior design, and furniture pieces. Um, we try to uh, mix our design between uh, architecture, art, and the psychological kind of uh, study into spaces. Okay. Because we believe how spaces have huge impact on our feelings and emotions. So Absolutely. we just try to, to look at it from that direction. So how does it make you feel when you walk in here? <laughs> <laughs> like work in progress. <laughs> okay, get motivated to get it done. <laughs> yes, um, the idea behind the studio, the design of the studio is to divide it into different zones. Okay. The display zone, which is very minimal white, to kind of provide a background to the pieces that we make. Mm -hmm. um, this design area is more of industrial feel to it yeah. because it's like the workshop where we get It's our like in the process. Yeah, <laughs> and it's more like experimental kind of, um, again, just work in progress. <laughs> okay, uh, let's talk about um, uh, the process of your business because this is your first actual store. Mm -hmm. So before doing this, what, do, what did you used to do? I worked as an architect mm -hmm. in uh, three different firms in Scotland and in Bahrain. Okay. And um, then I just decided to start my own only because, especially in the field of design, you just really need that kind of freedom. And, um, you need to have your own vision. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Uh, let's talk about uh, the empowerment of women. Of course, again, you're a Bahraini businesswoman, now you're a business owner. Um, what kind of support have you received uh, in terms of uh, starting this store, being in Riyadh and everything else? Um, I have to say that the support offered by uh, BDB, Tankin, uh, Supreme Council for Women, BBIC, mm -hmm. uh, has been huge in terms of financial or even um, moral support. Yes. It's not only providing us with confidence, but also it's, um, it's like a practical test to our experience uh, in the field and our abilities, mm -hmm. which um, it's not only for us to compete, but also to be part of the development of industries, which is what we all need. <laughs> is there something you'd like to say on the occasion of Women's Day in Bahrain? It's great to be a part of the production field or industries mm -hmm. and to feel that we have kind of an input in it. You're adding value to it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we wish you all the best. Thank you so much. And for all your work in progress, we wish <laughs> you success. You. Thank, Thank you. you so much. We're so proud of you as a Bahraini businesswoman Thank always. Thank you.